Yo, so I was checking to make sure my recording didn't lag, and I, uh, I found a bug. Check this out. Ready? Did you catch that? Because, why is this pink? Believe it or not, this is actually my first game playing with these new crossovers. I know it's been like a week, but, it, you know, I've been, I've been busy. I can get into that later, but I even avoided using any of the SIGs. I don't have any jumps! Okay, I didn't know. That's cool. I guess you know how I feel about that test feature change. I've also made a full video on it, so you probably already knew. But yeah, I, I don't know the full SIG kits on any of these, so we'll test them out together and uh, I'll get my impressions. I'm gonna assume these are pretty similar to Ryu's because, I mean, it's Ryu and Ken. It, it, that just makes sense. I've got a Fire Fist instead. Yeah, I've, I've also got a Tatsumaki. That one has audio cues. It has like sound, whatever. I don't know what to call it. Voice lines. That's the proper term. I'm a fan of voice lines. I hope maybe old legends can get some of those as well. That would be, that'd be pretty awesome. I've been really busy. I can get into that a little bit, which is that school has been nuts. I've also, uh, I've been trying to be more social. You know, I've talked a lot about having issues on that front. So I've been trying to force myself into scenarios where I could be engaging with other people. And I did a bit of invasion. I just got hit there. I, whoops. I was going to say invasion into Normandy, June 6th, 1944, going into normal person territory, talking to people that don't spend their entire lives on the internet like me. Uh, in front of a computer screen. And I made some interesting realizations, but before I talk about that, uh, I didn't use the SIGs. I didn't, I didn't like use them at all. There's the fire one. That blast is, is pretty cool. I don't know why I said there's the fire one. They're probably all fire ones, but let me just use all of the SIGs on all the crossovers. There's five of them. This might take a little while. And, uh, and we already saw this uppercut. We'll see if I can get a kill with it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this is very similar to Ryu, which I think makes a lot of sense. I don't have any qualms about that. You know, being able to swap between the two is kind of nice. You can have a 2v2 team with Ryu and Ken pretty sick nasty you could say i think i'm out of jumps here yeah you could say it's my own fault that i don't know how many jumps i have um you could say it's my own fault that <laughs> i got hit there but look i don't know what i'm doing i'm a little baby okay i need to be spoon fed all my information okay you could tell me in the first match i could have just like chase dodged up to live or i could have just counted i can't count okay there's only so many things i can keep in my head at the same time case in point the fact that i haven't even used all six sigs yet let's see about this one do i get a big ball of flames and does it have like a weird glitch where it disappears in this oh wow that, that worked there or it disappears in the second half i'm gonna presume not let's just give it a little test because that was a, a bug when ryu came out <laughs> but uh no it appears to just be a normal version of the sig which is quite nice i think the only two that are left is this down sig and the hadouken let's see if i can get that down sig it might take a couple tries it's not the easiest sig in the world to hit because it does have a bunch of startup so we'll see maybe i can catch a dodge maybe someone falling down they didn't fast fall if they did i have a feeling going for the weapon though yeah and i shoot out a little fireball i'm realizing i have five characters to get through and the first three in this video have all been ken i should probably speed up this process a little bit i don't need those get that out of my face please please okay okay just so weapon spawns i can't keep hitting those weapon spawns and then hadoken there we go he's got a he's got a little baby boy voice compared to the big man ryu which is don't kill thank you i just want to hit one move I just, it's all i want it's all i've ever wanted it's all i've ever needed just jump into it please i'm out of jumps yeah I, why did the sweat beads not come up until later i don't understand i don't understand the change it doesn't why did this thing disappear okay i would it is bugged I don't know. I'm going to have to watch that one back. I was talking about disappearing SIGs and then maybe I just wanted one to will into existence. I don't know. I, I, maybe that's how it's supposed to look. It beats me. Let me talk about M. Bison. Don't know any of his SIGs either. Again, I've just been saving them in the, in the queue. How many jumps do I have? <laughs> okay, I'm fine. As long as I'm like not dead, I'm okay with it. And uh, I sent them up there on purpose so that I could bring them back down. I don't know. Knowing the amount of options is so key. And yeah, let's see some of these sigs. Let's see about the down sig. What happens here? I do a bit of a dive kick. That move does spike if you weren't aware. Although, <laughs> if I use it twice in a row, there it's probably not gonna work. If you charge it a little bit, you can go a little bit further down, like that. And then, and then the jumps again. The jumps. I don't feel like I'm earning these kills. And you could say it's just our fault for not being better gamers, but that one looks like it's pretty much the very similar animation. Oh, it has a little. You hear that? It's going like. Interesting. Down right here. That was the best download you've ever seen. Look, it got me a kill. It got me a kill. You can't tell me it wasn't the best downlight. You can't tell me. I don't know why I keep getting Demon Island. I'm not complaining. I'm up against a 10 strand Zill, so that's absolutely terrifying. I gotta say that dive kick animation, I'm, I'm, that's pretty cool. I'm a fan of that, you know. You gotta get those dive kicks. It's Street Fighter. Let's see about this side sick. I'm pretty sure I've seen this one. I'm pretty sure Bro Boomy sent me a video of it, or he sent everyone a video of it in the, the old cord. So that one is uh, it's a little bit crazy. I thought they would recover immediately. This sig already has a very deceiving hitbox for its animation, so I don't know how it matches up to this one, but we'll see. Maybe I can get a spike. Um... 
I'm gonna say that was a spike. I don't... Don't ask. I think the only one I've seen on the hammer is the NC, because I'm pretty sure it was shown in the trailer, although I can't remember. I barely... Look, you gotta understand something about me. If I watch something, I'm not gonna remember. I mean, you can tell based on how I read dodges. <laughs> they might dodge the same thing over and over again, and I still don't... Uh, I still don't get it. I don't know why I threw away my hammer there. I kind of needed it. I guess I haven't hit the, the N sig or the side sig yet, so... If they keep NSIG, maybe I'm able to. There's the NSIG. They get a little purple effect there, looks like. And then I get my dodge back relatively quickly there. It's two seconds. I haven't talked about the dodge changes at all. But the reason why is I just haven't played them. So I don't have any. <gasps> if they put the trap there, that would have been doomed for me. I should have backdashed or jumped up before I did that. Let's see. Let's see about this charge. Try to get that dodge down or something. That, that looks brutal. You're just ramming them. I think all that's left is the NSIG and the downsig on the hammer. Uh, I, I haven't hit this one, though. Okay, all that's left is the ending and the dancing on the hammer. There we go. I should do it this match, because I, sh I this this rate of plays is way too far. I'm getting demolished right now. I got hit, like, how many times? And I'm already hurting? All right, there we go. And then I can get a deadline into Ensig, maybe, to finish off this one. That'd be a nice little combo to get. I'm a good gamer. What? That's a crazy-looking hitbox. Um... Don't ask. Please don't ask. It's a true combo if you hit it close. I just can't hit it. <laughs> I just can't hit it close. All right. Um, let me yoss this one aside because it's not doing me any favors. I I'm going to try and get them to like end sig or something. Why did I say that? And then I jumped into it. You see what I'm saying? I'm not a good gamer. It's been a while. Okay. I've been busy. I've been busy. Please. Please. They jumped over it. All right. It's a lot. It's a lost cause. It's a lost cause. You know, I'm probably realizing I should have done this in Strikeout. That way I could get a bunch of them in one game, but that's fine. Swapping off the burning team captain of M. Bison onto Sakura now, who I don't know. who is this like the Ryu copycat? I, I can't remember. Look, I've watched. Oh, they fast fell. And now I'm dead. Okay, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. Thank you to the new dodge cooldown. I, I think she's like the copycat of Ryu. Look, I've watched a lot of Evos in my day, but I have not been keeping up with Street Fighter recently. I think she's an older character, though. The point why I say that, though, is I have no idea who Luke is. Am I alone there? Is he a new one? I know Street Fighter likes to put in like new characters in their promotions and stuff So he's probably a new character. No clue. Street Fighter 6 logo looks like it was made in Squarespace So I don't know what's going on here, but uh, regardless, let's look at these sigs I don't think I've um, hit a single one yet. So let's do that down. Oh, okay. That was almost death down sig here They dodged up. I think they probably knew I was going. I'm actually dead right here unless they come edge guard me um, I can't count my jumps Let's see my signatures, please. They got guns, so they might be hopping up in the air. I got hit by that on purpose so I could live, I promise. Um, I'm interested in the end sig because it's already a, a move with very minimal effects. I'm going to presume, yeah, it, it's also minimal effects. What is this? Flower petals? I can't, I can't tell. Or it's like purple energy. I'm pretty sure she's the Ryu copycat and she just like wants to use Hadoukens. Yeah, there is the Hadoken noise effect. There we go. Okay, what, what else is left? I need side sig on the cannon. There's the side sig on the cannon. That move... That jump is kind of wild, um, but Lin Fei also has a jump that's kind of wild, and yeah, it falls when you get knocked, or when you do it off stage, so that's why they weren't able to punish me there. Um, what else, what else, what else do I need to hit? I think I'm good. No, I need NSIG, I need, uh, yeah, yeah, there's the NSIG. That move has, like, a lot of active hitboxes on Lin Fei, so, uh, case in point right there, the people are probably gonna run into it, I was gonna presume, and, uh, my presumption was correct. Let's see if I can finish it off with that side zig, because I did, uh, end up killing me in the last stock, so. Some redemption would be nice, maybe a side light, spot dodge, and then they side zig. Or dodging. There we go. That force. I didn't realize it till I was on the loading screen, but I'm on strength stance cross, so if I do a bazillion damage, that's why. Eight strength is, uh, is nothing to scoff at, but Luke, the only moves that I know are the side zig on the gauntlets and then the down zig on the gauntlets, because I use those to make the, uh, the video, the old video. That was a great dodge read by me. Please work. They almost died from that. I died from that. That was the least worth NSIG of my life. Not only did it not hit, it wasn't going to hit. It got me killed. I didn't even see the effect. You know, it was it was not a good decision. Um, I got hit by that on purpose so I could get that final blow is what I'm going to tell myself when I hit the pillow at night. All right, let's see the moves. Let's see the moves. I know everyone's making a fuss about the side SIG, but what about the other ones? Okay, well, I can see why. There's no, like, ghost effect. That's the that's the thing. You need the ghost, the ghost of Luke's past. I don't know. What's it? What is this guy? Who is he? Okay, let's see the end zig now. I punched that. Okay, that's actually pretty good. <laughs> I punched directly upward. I like that one. I like that. I thought I was throwing grenades when I used it, like, up there. But no, it's just punching. That's interesting. I'm gonna die. I don't have jumps. It's fine. 
I almost jumped into that. Um, let's see. Down sig. So that that makes sense that that one's just like standard. I'm gonna die again. Um, this is not the good game to be. They're going nutso mode, and I'm. Okay, interesting, interesting. I I was thinking about doing a side sig, but if I didn't GC that one, I would have side sig. This looks like a dive kick. That's actually also really cool. A little bit deceiving though, because I just get rid of my guns in my hands, but. I don't know. I'm curious about what it looks like when I hit it. Although, I don't know if I'll get a chance. What else, what else do I need? I haven't seen Nzig on the gauntlets. I'm presuming that one's just going to be a standard punch. I mean, yeah, that makes sense. That makes a lot of sense. And then the down sig one, this one, is very hard to see on certain maps. Like, this traveling around the ground, I think the, the hand is a lot uh, easier to see. It's like the, the whole red. But maybe I'm just more used to it. I don't know. I might die. So, hold on. Hold the phones. Hold your temples. If that hit, I honestly probably would have killed. I, actually, I'm pretty sure. Strength stance? Yeah, that, that one kills. I GC side zigged. I promise you, it wouldn't have hit. No, I try to pick up my guns and I drop them. Okay, I'm not gonna walk into that one. Bomb in the air. Into hand of God. Nice. All right, it's not worth playing a whole game for this. Let's hope I don't get in the QA. There's the, the, the guns. Okay, cool. It's a headbutt. All right, finally, I'm playing some Dalsim. He's the one I was most looking forward to. I love Dalsim. Look, everyone loves this stretchy boy. Let's see his sigs, because a lot of people have been talking about them. I don't know if they're, like, super misleading or anything. Let let's just see. Let's just see. Okay, that is a bit of an issue. You see, Rayman spins his circles in his arm. Nah. He spins his arms in a big circle, and it's very easy to see. But this one, he's like one elbow joint away from just T-posing and standing completely still. I think that's a bit of an issue. That dodge in there was actually pretty dangerous. Okay, I think that needs to be a lot more clear. That one, too. Yeah, okay. Some kind of, like, clearer indication, I think, would be fantastic there. That, and then the down sig. Yeah, he just hops into the air. There's no, like, big audio cue with the helicopter or anything. Yeah, these Dalsim sigs are kind of crazy. What about the axe? Let's see about the axe. Does this one have any? Okay, it's like flame bolts instead of the, the little mini guys. That, that makes sense. This is the first Rayman crossover. I didn't think Rayman could even like get a crossover. I thought it would be like copyright law or something. This one, that's that's also kind of wild. Oh, I thought they were trying to chase me. I was going to do a GC. And do I slide on my axe here? I do slide. Okay, I like that. Okay, look. Dalsim, his sigs are insane. I think they need way clearer animations. But the animations are also pretty funny. They're, they're pretty funny. They're... I mean, look at that. What was that? Yeah, so after this, I told a story about how someone was talking about imposter syndrome, and I asked them if they had Among Us disease. So I don't want to get into that. Just look at this kill. It, like, trapped them with the thing. Bye.